Hello viewers, learners, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to PMS Edu Dax Talks in Training. Dear viewers, if you are really watching the first time, subscribe, hit all button for your future notification and decide this is the right platform to accumulate passive information, ideas, even suggestions. Dear viewers, I have requested all my videos. Why don't you spread the news to the club and the community where you live? Dear viewers, I know you are really busy with your schedules, your official and your personal. Though you are spending your valuable time with me and the channel. Thanks for watching and supporting. Again and again, I request watch all my videos. Go back all my videos and watch. Be patient and learn to speak in English. Today's topic is understanding strategies implementation for improving English language structure. Dear learners, learn the structure and the strategies to improve your communication skill. I am going to introduce 8 strategies and structure. Kindly be patient and follow and learn to speak in English. The first solution Grammar Awareness Dear viewers, most of them have misguided you that Come on, without grammar, you are able to communicate or build a sentence. It's wrong information which they have misguided. I'm against that again. The first, aware of the grammar, basic grammar. If you know the basic grammar, it's easy to build your communication skill effectively. First, know strategies. Understand the parts of speech. What is verb? What is subject? What is adjective? What is noun? Dear viewers, if you don't know about parts of speech and the role of the part of speech in sentence, go back to all my videos and find the role of part of speech and the structure. Example, the cat chased the playful mouse. You should know the role and the identification of part of speech and its structure. The cat, subject, chased, verb, playful, adjective, Again, the adjective qualifies a noun mouse. So this is the way you should identify the part of speech and the role. If you know the aware of grammar, the basic grammar, the structure, it's easy to build and you can start with the communication whom you like to speak. The second solution is syntax recognition. Learn the strategies first. There are many structures in English. First, learn and understand the structure, such as yes plus we and yes plus v plus io plus do. Dear viewers, there are many number of structures in English. I'm going to introduce two method. Try to learn and try to think in English and try to communicate whom you like to speak. The example of S plus V plus O. She read a fascinating book. She is a subject. Read is a verb. A fascinating book is an object. And second structure is yes plus V plus I O plus D O. 
she gave me a book she is a subject gave past tense of verb and me is an indirect object and a book is a direct object do you wish go back to all my videos and learn related there are many videos be patient and watch and learn if you know the structure in english it's easy to communicate it's easy to think in english you can avoid directly translating your mother tongue to english that's what first you learn the power of speech and its role and the structure dear viewers really literally i'm against without grammar you cannot you fail to build a communication and it's meaningless related i have given a videos try to go back and watch the third solution is vocabulary expansion first understand the strategy dear viewers regularly learn new words and the usage in context recently i requested all my videos try to persist the habit of jot outing or finding new unfamiliar words and its meaning and its usage and i requested use pocket dictionary or english app kindly spend at least daily half an hour learning new words and its structure what i did you know i learned new words and trying to build a sentence even i speak out to my friends or even i write it write down the way you have to expand your vocabulary is the author employed instead used viewed instead colorful language it described the both taking stunning scenery so this is how you have to expand your vocabulary dear viewers try to learn anonyms and synonyms even for a particular word find out what is anonyms what is synonyms you should know all this structure that is the way you can expand your vocabulary don't mind you can think in english we have enough time stand in the mirror and try to construct a sentence is this the easiest way the beginners to build a communication skill the fourth solution is sentence analysis dear viewers first let's learn the strategy break down the complex sentence into simple components for better comprehension dear viewers you should know to analyze the sentence structure identify the length of the sentence and the constructing the building of the structure first you know this the length it's easy to analyze what is the sentence and how it's built example although it was raining they desired to go for walk here you should analyze the sentence although it's a subordinating conjunction it's a conjunction and it's subordinating conjunction it was raining it was raining it's a independent classes though they desired go for a walk dependent class it was was it's a past be verb and raining past continuous tense independent classes means it stand alone and it gives a complete meaning and it express complete idea or thoughts so here it was raining independent class 
though they desire to go for walk it is dependent clash what is dependent clash it cannot stand alone it won't give meaning and it, it doesn't express a complete thoughts or idea so this is how we need to analyze the sentence if you know how to analyze the sentence and structure it's easy to think in english and to build a communication or construct even spoken and even written the fifth solution is understanding conductual dear viewers what does it meaning understanding conductual let's know the strategy consider the surrounding the words the decipher the meaning of the particular words dear viewers first you know the word and the different meanings if you know the different meanings so then you can find the particular meanings in the particular sentence so that is what you can build it or construct a meaningful sentence dear viewers example let's take the path can mean a flying mammal or it's a sports equipment understanding the different context so this is how you have to analyze and understand the context or knowing the different meanings knowing that it's easy to build and construct the sentence while writing even it's useful knowing the different sentence and different meanings so dear viewers while reading more articles first you understand the context and analyze the sentence and try to think in english and build a communication skill sixth solution is practice with variety first let's know the strategy engage in diverse reading materials to encounter different structure and the style and the method how they used in english so dear viewers first you should go different materials and while reading pay attention concentrate literally knowing the style the different method and how they used as in structure do you ever see learn newspaper novels and the academic text or articles if you go variety definitely you may learn the variety styles and method and the structures first you should decide what kind of podcast you can listen even choose the particular native speakers don't go and follow all native speakers find and search the right person who is properly guiding and you can watch non native speakers podcasting and also you can have a good contact with the fluent speakers that is a way you can enrich your communication skill that is meaning is you can practice with variety of reading and listening even find the speaking partner who speaks fluently who could guide you properly once you analyze this area you can easily improve or you can easily build your communication skill without waiting your perfection start from today try to communicate try to launch your conversation whom you like or even you can start to the strangers the seventh solution is active listening dear viewers first let's know the strategy pay attention and give 
your ear carefully. What the trying to the speaker is going to deliver before understanding or knowing you should not reply to the speaker. Analyze what he is trying to deliver, understand the message and the information, then you can reply to them. While listening, why don't you analyze the natural flow and the intonation and the sentence structure, how the speaker builds the sentence, the rising tone and falling tone, and with the modulation. Dear viewers, you don't particularly spend time for listening. Whom you're trying to speak, pay attention, or listen properly. That's enough. If you have enough time, you can listen to podcast and you can e even engage in conversation with the fluent speakers and your mentors and your trainers. Concentrate while you speak and find out the right podcast. Even you can suggest PMS Edu Dax Toxin Training. It's a podcasting, it's a talks and it's a training. The eighth solution is writing practice. The viewers first learn the strategy. Regularly write essays, stories or journal to entries learned structure. Example, grafting sentence like, first let's give introduction and followed by the main character and the sub characters and the important points and even you can end with the conclusion. So this is how you need to practice any essays or any novels. Keep writing. If you keep writing any stories or any novels or any essays, this is the way to build your writing skill. Once you know to write, it's easy to build to speak out. So try to practice again and again for writing. If you know any kind of a vocabulary, try to frame, try to describe an object.